doesn't look the prettiest, but she works. I'm gonna put metal up the whole wall just to be on the safe side. You know, can't be too safe with this, but just being in here, I mean, it's getting toasty. So it's not gonna take much to warm the cabin up. I give you more of a picture of the cabin, but it is an absolute disaster with the construction and everything. So I don't wanna show it. <laughs> but there we go. We uh, ended up doing a few modifications. I haven't got a door that I like yet. But I'm going to re redo a door. Put a screen in there to keep everything up off the ground. And in time, I think I'm going to get some small fire bricks maybe. I would like to uh, upgrade it. This is the 9 mil box. I think I would like to upgrade it to the 50 cal. And do some things different. Because this one's not pretty. But... It's going to be very cold this week, and this will definitely do the trick. So, I'm going to do some more work, and I'll hit you guys back up when I have everything finished. So, yeah, I might have went overboard with putting the metal up, but never can be that safe. I redid the, put more metal on the floor, too. And, uh, we got it all watered tight and everything. So, I think we're doing good. You know. These kind of projects, they go on forever. It never really ends, it seems like. But yeah, little bitty heater's doing fairly well. It's not the prettiest looking thing in the world, but it does fairly well. So, got that part done. Catch y'all next time. There she is, just a cooking away. Put a little camo up just to, when I'm not around, I can drop it down and hide the window, just so nobody sees it. Still got a little junk on the ground, clear up. A little stack of firewood. Hard to see if you can tell. So what I did was I papered the roof, and then I'm gonna cover it with a uh, liquid plastic. I saw it on another video. There you go. And there's the star. And there's the star.